Hey you guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm sharing another Stitch Fix unboxing and try on. If you guys are not familiar, Stitch Fix is a styling service where you are matched with a personal stylist that picks and chooses pieces for you based on your wants, your needs, and what you are looking to amp up your wardrobe with. With Stitch Fix, they have a variety of pieces. They have clothes, shoes, accessories. They also have men's, women and children's now. If you are interested in signing up for Stitch Fix, I will have a link in the description box down below. I've mentioned a ton of times, but I've tried out a bunch of different styling services and Stitch Fix is definitely my favorite. I have found pieces from Stitch Fix that are truly staples in my wardrobe, pieces that I've received like last year that I still wear this year. But I do wanna keep this intro short because I have some pretty good pieces today to share with you guys. So if you're interested in seeing this Stitch Fix unboxing and try on, then please keep watching. So the first piece I have to share with you guys is a pair of pants. I am wearing these pants with all the other tops, so I figured I would just get these out of the way first. They are from the brand Liverpool. They are the Jaclyn Skinny Pant in a size 14, and these cost $78. So this is what the pants look like here. They are a dark purple jegging. They have a ton of stretch in them. They fit very comfortably on the bottom. Almost kind of feels like you're wearing some PJs. Um, they do not have true front pockets but they do actually have pockets in the back and then they do not have any distressing on them at all but we do have the skinny ankle at the bottom lengthwise these fit me really really great um, they were actually just a little long which isn't a big deal for me personally I just like the way that pants look rolled up anyway with booty so that's what I did it wasn't a big deal but I would say these are definitely tall girl friendly as I did have some extra length in them um, the only issue for me personally with this pair of pants is is they are not a high rise fit. They do fit me more mid rise, but like a lower mid rise where they're kind of hitting at like the largest part of my stomach, which is definitely not my preference. So these are gonna be a pass for me just based on that. But other than that, I mean, I really, really like these a lot. I think the color is absolutely beautiful and I love the way I actually have them paired with this sweater that I have next to share with you guys. So this sweater here is from the brand RD Style. This is the Timon V-neck tunic length pullover in the color camel. It's in a size extra large and this one costs $68. So this is what the sweater looks like here. As mentioned in the title, it does have the V-neck design in the front and it is kind of like an oversized fit. This one actually has stretch in it, so it just fit really comfy, really slouchy. You could easily pull this one kind of off of the shoulder if you want to wear it with like a bralette underneath. I think that would look really cute. This one has long sleeves, and then on both sides of the sweater, there are slits on both sides. And this one is actually a little bit longer in the back as well, so if you wanted to wear this with leggings, I do think this would be a really good piece to do so, because it does cover the butt. I think this sweater is absolutely great. I love the color on it. It is so incredibly comfy. It does kind of look like it's going to be scratchy just based on the material, but honestly wearing it, you don't feel any scratchiness at all. And I'm very sensitive to fabric and I thought this one was very comfortable. I love the stretch in here. Um, I love the color again. I like the way the color looks with those purple pants, but the one thing I will say, the price tag is a little high, $70 for the sweater. It's not the worst, but I feel like it's so basic that I could find a similar piece to this one at like maybe like Old Navy. So I'm having a hard time with this one. Please let me know what your thoughts are on this one down below. I think when you guys are gonna be watching this video, I have like maybe one day left to send my box back. So I'd love to hear what your opinions are, um, what your favorites are, of course, and let me know in the comments down below. Speaking of sweaters, I did actually receive one more. This one is, again, from the brand RD Style. This is the Mayana Open Cardigan in a size extra large, and this one costs $78. The price tag, again, on this one, I feel like is very high, um, but this is a open knit cardigan, 
and it is actually camo print you guys look how cute that is so it's like gray like a super dark gray and then the black um, camo print it's adorable I love this again the same kind of material as the last one where it almost looks like it would be scratchy but it actually was very very comfortable on the body um, this one also has some stretch to it as well I did go ahead and pair it with a black bodysuit and the burgundy or like those purple pants from before and I thought that looked really cute actually it would be something very different than what I normally wear again though the price tag on this piece $78 for one cardigan is about killing me and I will be honest with you guys I did see a very very similar cardigan to this one at Fashion Nova so it was also camo print and I do believe that one was like gray camo as well I can link it down below if you guys are interested I do think I am going to go ahead and opt for that one rather than this one just based on price alone the quality of course feels absolutely amazing Amazing. but the one thing for me is am I going to be able to wear this cardigan for seasons after seasons and I just don't know if I can because it is a little bit more trendy so again let me know what you guys think about this one down below this next piece here is literally the epitome of trendy this is from the brand Alice Blue this is the La Thin printed faux fur jacket in a size extra large and this one cost $58 I'm pretty sure I butchered that name so it'll be linked down below if you guys want to know the exact name but like I said this is the epitome of trendy animal print is very very much in right now obviously I have been loving the leopard um, as I'm wearing it right now plus I've showed a hundred different leopard pieces here on my channel if you guys like this sweater I do have on right now um, I will be sharing it next Next week on my channel so look out for that but this is actually a Sherpa leopard zip up jacket so I did try on a jacket very similar to this one from American Eagle I will be honest I did go ahead and actually buy that one from American Eagle and I ended up returning it because I don't know the fit on it was like a little odd for me it just wasn't long enough on the body and I'm just not 100% sure like I really like the way it looked when I tried it on for you guys but just having it at home I just didn't feel like I was ever going to gravitate towards it but I will say the length on this one is a little bit better so I am leaning towards keeping this piece plus it's Sherpa it's super cozy delicious Sherpa there are pockets on this one it has a hood as well and it zips up in the center I mean I don't know I just think it's so cute but it's like I have a lot of Sherpa jackets and I also have a lot of like leopard tops do I need it? Absolutely not. Do I want it? Absolutely. I do also have a gift card that I just remembered about um, that I've had for a while now and I haven't had a chance to use it. So I'm like, well, I won't really be paying that much if I use my gift card. So I don't know. Let me know what you guys think about this one down below. I would love, love to hear from you. And the very last piece for today's Stitch Fix unboxing is actually a pair of booties. I rarely receive shoes from Stitch Fix. So I always get very excited when I do get a pair in. These are from the brand Report Footwear. These are the Drew perforated booty in a size 10 and these cost $65 so this is what the booties look like here they're absolutely adorable they're in this beautiful chestnut color they have the little like hole like little holes all over them in the front they have this stretch panel on the side um, and then the very tiniest little heel on the back I think they're adorable I will say I have a very similar pair of booties to these from I think they're from Target last year. They were a little bit darker and I feel like the heel was a little bit bigger. So I'm just not, not going to keep these. I also literally have like 500 boots currently that my like closet is literally like throwing them up like because they just don't fit in there. So I'm gonna have to pass. I do think they're absolutely adorable and I have tried out other shoes from the Report 
um, footwear line and I've liked them so far as well. And before we go ahead and wrap up today's video, I do want to talk about the price. So if I were to keep all five pieces, my total would be $347. However, Stitch Fix does give you 25% off if you do keep all five pieces. So my total then goes down to $260.25. Um, $260.25 really isn't the absolute worst in comparison to what the prices are individually and the quality that you're getting. I personally, though, am not going to keep all of these pieces. I would like to keep at least one because I do really like this box, and but I'm having a hard time trying to decide which one. So let me know in the comments down below what piece you guys think I should um, keep. I would love to hear from you. I think my next Stitch Fix unboxing um, will probably be more holiday inspired because that is definitely the vibe that I'm moving towards. Um, so do make sure you subscribe so you don't miss that one. If you enjoyed today's video, make sure you give this one a thumbs up. Like I said, subscribe if you haven't already and check out my Instagram. I'll have it linked in the description box down below. I do post on Instagram pretty much every day. Um, so if you're not following me already on there, I would love to see you there as well. I love getting to chat with you guys on a more intimate basis on Instagram. Um, but that is actually going to do it for today's video. So thank you all so, so much for watching. I hope you have an amazing day, amazing week, and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye guys.